So the quick fix is taking a bit of a hit, but while it might be down, it sure as hell isn't out. It seems to me that we forget why we all really love the quick fix, and that's this little number right here. Lately, playing Medic has gotten more and more like water skiing, but thanks to this repurposed blender, gravity binds me no longer. Medical man, away! All right, so <clears throat> in uh, all honesty, I had no idea exactly how the jumping mechanic worked. And when I say that, I really mean I just dicked around with it for an hour. Contrary to popular belief, the quick fix does not just mirror the direction and speed of whoever you're healing. All the quick fix does is take that same force pushing your heal target from any surface and replicates that on you. This means that it works on floors, walls, hell, <laughs> even ceilings if you for some odd reason really, really want some unnecessary fall damage. Now, the biggest problem with this whole mechanic is that your target needs to come in contact with at least some sort of surface before he can launch you again, meaning that the Soli Pogo unfortunately just doesn't work. Whether or not this is a bug, I have no idea, but either way, it's kind of a big deal. You know, that, that, that's fine though, that's fine, they can fix the promos first, I am totally cool with that. One of the weird things about quick fix jumping is you realize how great of a rocket jumper the medic actually is. I mean, anyone who's played on a randomizer server can say if you get some sort of explosives as a medic, you can jump really far, and this is no different whatsoever. I guess after years of fine tuning the rocket jumping process, they've toned down its effectiveness on the demo and soldier, but the med on the other hand takes to the skies like an elegant rocket. And honestly, if he's not careful, he'll end up flying miles farther than whoever he's healing. So how do you do it right? Well, the biggest help is having someone who can actually fucking rocket jump. God forbid you're teaming up with someone like yours truly who has the rocket jumping skills of a cinder block. It's also pretty crucial to actually talk to whoever you're hitching a ride with, which is why I personally recommend lobbing up with a friend or two, especially if you're going for that hardcore high-flying healer experience. You can maybe get away with riding the coattails of a passing soldier, but otherwise, most of those randoms are going to leave you in the shithouse. Obviously, coordination is key, and more importantly, knowing where you're going is kinda important. Your movement does in fact have an effect on where you're getting air mailed, so it's best to be moving in that same direction, and crouch jumping right before the launch has the same effect on you as it does the soldier. Whether the person on the other end is a demo, a soldier, or hell, even a pyro as it turns out, the key is timing it right. Make sure the pocket makes contact with the ground before he jumps again, and more importantly, don't lose sight of your jump buddy. Worth keeping in mind, if the kitchen's too hot, you can always have your pocket launch you out of there. And on the flip side, if you're sprouting a third testicle and you're starting to feel a little brave, don't be afraid to have your friend air drop you into the fray. Nobody ever expects the med bombing. Nobody. Once you've got it down, all that's left to do is enjoy yourself. Alexander the Great ain't shit to a god. King Henry the Eighth ain't shit to a god. Putting food on the plate ain't shit to a god. No, ain't shit to a god. Thousand bricks of the day ain't shit to a god. Smoking weed every day ain't shit to a god. Picasso and Monet ain't shit to a god. Shit to a god. Ain't shit to a god. If you can see me now, it's like it would all make sense. It would click, the fog would be lifted Chances are you then leave addicted It's scripted, the elders predicted You know why I'm here and you're there Wooden stool versus lazy armchair You wouldn't ask why I bought both pairs You just know, then you'd act like you don't care It's a shame you'd be lame like that Everybody'd know you became like that People see me in my hall of fame like that With my face in the frame like that If you could see me now Ten bucks you'd be pissed You'd realize cats like me exist Proceed to complain that you're not on the list Or get nervous and just plead the fifth I'm just saying But hey Going big, Mr. Burns. Ain't shit to a god. Everyday thoughts and concerns. Ain't shit to a god. Yo, those stacks that you earn. Ain't shit to a god. No. God, god, god. Ain't shit to a god. Harassing that wall. Ain't shit to a god. White sand baccarat. Ain't shit to a god. International law. Ain't shit to a god. Ain't shit to a god. Ain't shit to a shit to a god. Shit to a god. Ain't shit to a shit.